Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Olivia Jade. If you're new here, what's up? I am showing you some hairstyles for my short hair now. I recently chopped my hair. If you guys missed the vlog, I'll link it down below. But yeah, she gone. I'm the worst at hair. So I've had to try and find really easy hairstyles that don't require heat or effort or anything because I realized I don't even know how to curl short hair anymore. I just got semi-decent and that's still bad at curling long hair so it's been a really big struggle. I just thought I'd do some heatless hairstyles that I've been going for lately. I'm not claiming that these are like great or amazing or revolutionary. They're honestly pretty bad um, but I like them. I think it's cute. It's messy. It's kind of like model off duty vibes. So if you want to see what I've been doing then just keep watching. I love you guys and I hope you enjoy. Okay, so for hairstyle number one, it's just going to be two little braids. So you can part your hair however. This is super easy and it's going to play into our next hairstyle. You just take one section and do normal braids. I prefer doing this like super messy and like tousled. If you don't know how to braid, I promise you can learn because if I can braid, anyone can braid because I can't do any sort of fancy braid. So you just take the three strands of hair and repeatedly twist them like this. What's so nice about short hair is everything's so fast. I'm the worst at hair and I still think it's cute. See, like that looks so cute and I love the idea and look of like little baby braids. They're so cute. Okay, and then you just do the exact same thing to this side. So you split your hair into three sections. I like doing um, the front, pulling it back first because then it's like out of your face. My hair is like almost not long enough to do this. But yeah, I just twist as much as I can. And then when it kind of gets like hard, I just tie it off okay so once that is done i like to just grab it you can pull some pieces out this is the first look i think it's just so cute and little and i'm really into short hair because of this hairstyle i've been doing it all the time so that's first for the next look i'm gonna keep the braids for right now and i just take any sort of like mist something that's gonna get your hair a little bit wet so it kind of holds the shape of the braid you'll see what i mean so i'm just taking this curled quench um oil hydrating mist and i'm just gonna kind of spray like right where the curl of the braid is okay and then i take my hair out of that and it kind of gives it like a little bit of shape nothing crazy just like a little a little bit and then what i like to do is take some sort of like texture spray. So this one's by IGK. I just mess it up like this. And that's literally my second hairstyle. I know it's nothing crazy. If you just wanted to add a little something to your hair, have like a little crimp, that's that. My hair's shorter in the back too. Sorry, this bra doesn't, <laughs> I'm a mess. For the third hairstyle, for this one, I like to put my hair half up, half down. It's almost like I'm just taking it really messy like this. And then I just kind of do like a little bun. This one's mostly like trial and error for me. Sometimes it looks good, sometimes it doesn't. Then I just take a little bit more texture spray. Pull a few pieces out. I think it's so cute, you just tie it up like that. Bam, you can like little pieces like this. I like to leave out for like the little messy effect, but if you wanna like pin it or just use your hair tie to push it in, you do it all again. My fourth look. So you can part your hair to whatever side you like. I like my part going like not, like I mean a side part. Whatever side part you like better. So either this way or this way. Yeah, I like this way better. Okay, so once you get your side part, just make sure it's brushed off into your two different sections. Cool. And then I just take my hair and hold it. And then I brush down this side. I never knew how easy short haired girls had it for hairstyling. It makes life so much easier. And then once it's all flat, I just take it into a little ponytail. And then right before I go through my full pony, I stop like this and pull. So it's like a little half bun pony situation. That usually works better. Let me do one more loop. There. See? I don't know if you could tell. <laughs> but it just is like this really cute little sleek bun. And then if you want to pull out a few front pieces to frame your face, you totally can. Um, but yeah, super cute. So. <laughs> so then again, just my other one is parting it to whatever side you like. Um, I noticed with short hair, I like having a side part more than a middle part now. So that's something to think of if 
you don't like your short hair, try parting it to the side. Just add a little texture spray. So this is my next hairstyle. I know the this one and the other one where it was down are just basic, but it's how I've been wearing my hair, so I thought I'd show you. This next one is going to be a middle part. So get it as best as you can. My middle parts are never perfect, if you want to know a secret about me. So I just brush it out, and then I just take my hair like this and throw it directly back like this and i just do a little ponytail tie that tight you can use like an oil if you want to do super sleek hair but since i'm going somewhere after this i don't want my hair to be oily so that's what this one looks like obviously really basic but i don't know i like it what do you think and then i have another Updo. If you can't tell, I suck at hair, so I'm showing you the basic of the basic. Maybe you just haven't thought to do this yet. I'm not saying like these are expert hairstyles because clearly they're not. Um, this next one, I'm gonna do another side part. Cool. And then, oh, see, it just looks so cute. I love short hair. After I do my little side part, I like to bring it up like this. Obviously, it's gonna be crazy at first, so just kind of like brush it out, work with it, whatever you gotta do. And then I just like going like this. And then the back is always the crazy part. I like that the back though always gets like a little bit of height. And then I just take it and do like a really quick um, like pony bun sort of thing. You can just brush back any parts. Okay, so I just bring out these two little pieces and leave them kind of like behind my ear or you can bring them forward. It's like a little messy high ponytail. It's nothing crazy once again. My other hairstyle I'm going to show you guys. So you act like you're going full pony and then... The more you bring it up, kind of like the more falls down, you can get like a general idea of what you want it to look like. And then I just bring it up and do a super messy top ponytail like this. And then I bring out the sides. And guess what I'm going to add? Texture spray. If you want more hair below, obviously, just don't put as much on top. But So the next one I'm going to do is just kind of like a mid bun with all your hair back. So I just go like this. And I take it like to here. So I also just do a little pony this way. But I just like to do as much as I can up there. And then I know some of it fell. Which I'm fine with. If you don't like that, you can obviously pin it up. I'm all about like the messy look though. Just like that. I don't know. It's not anything like crazy. It's just like a little messy ponytail. It's something that I do. Or a little bun. Like just you throw it up and it's like no effort required sort of thing. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. I'm not claiming that these are like some revolutionary hairstyles. I'm just showing you like my go-to um, style since I've chopped my hair. So this is... You don't even have to think of it like tutorials, just like some ideas if you also suck at hair and you literally have no idea what to do. Thank you for watching. I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new here and I'll see you next time. Peace out.